information tonight on the heroin epidemic plaguing our communities and one mother's mission to make a difference. Since Sunday, Cleveland police have responded to at least three opiate-related overdoses, including one death, while Cleveland police carry Narcan to help save lives. And Rob, I hear an Akron mother is actually taking steps to make sure officers have help on the front lines of this addiction fight. That's exactly what's happening. Classes are filling up, too, but there's still room and there's still time to save lives. The Summit County Health Department is getting out in front of this heroin epidemic. News 5 anchor Frank Wiley explains they've teamed up now with Akron Say No to Dope to educate the entire community, Frank. Well, Rob, the lesson brings students face to face with death. People have enrolled to save loved ones or, in this case, even a stranger. It has been normalized. I keep my um, Narcan kit in my car. Some hands have saved lives, but many couldn't stop it from slipping away. I lost my daughter um, June 9th in 2016. Brenda Cameron Ryan has walked folks through every step. I know that uh, parents have came to this class, so they have this Narcan available in case their own child overdoses. It rarely falls in any particular order, denial, grief, and anger. And like addiction, loved ones often recover and relapse. The CDC can't figure this out. The government can't figure this out. You know, we're just, we're just soldiers in this war trying to, to put a dent into it. That leaves a pit in her stomach. Brenda and the Summit County Health Department have trained 130 people on how to use Narcan kits, the drug that reverses overdose. But the death toll shows some people are out of reach. I question if this war could ever be won. She took over for her daughter. Brenda's now raising her grandson. They just um, approved to have Narcan in Akron High School. Enrollment in classes hasn't kept up with the names of those who have died. By the way, classes are free and they are held on the final Tuesday of the month. The number to sign up is on news5cleveland.com.